What's going on guys, my name is Carl from Techademics and today I'm going to show you how you can remove the background from an image and make it look like a PNG file or maybe you just want to change the background yourself. Uh, so it's very easy, it's only a couple steps to do and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So the first thing you want to do is go to file and open and you want to open the image that you want to alter. So I've chosen this image here because it's an easy image to work with and it also gives you a good uh, easy demonstration on how to do this so you can actually understand it better when you do it yourself. So once you've opened your image what you want to do is unlock the layer so you can click the unlock button and if you want to lock it back up click this here and unlock it. So the first thing you want to do is go to the eraser tool here and you want to drag over it and you want to select the magic eraser tool. Now what this will do is basically quite a lot of the work for you. So all you want to do is click on the white background here and that's just basically going to remove the background just like that. And what you can do if I click back up here I can move the banana around as if it's just the banana uh, without a background. Um, obviously you can drag it on top of other images or do whatever. Uh, so let's just say that I didn't want to do that, so if we go back by a step backwards, Control alt z and have our uh, background to come back up. There's also another way to do this, so my GeForce experience has come up, they want that. So another way you can do this is click on this lasso tool here and you click on quick selection tool and then we can drag over the banana just like this and if I click delete now it's just going to delete the banana which I don't want to do so I'm going to go back and you want to click on uh, where is it if I can find it yep so you want to click on select here and you want to click on inverse or shift control I and it's basically going to inverse what was already selected so instead of selecting banana it's going to select all around it and now I want to click delete and yet again it's going to remove the background and to remove these sort of lines you want to click control D and yet again it's removed it just like we did before so it's very easy so thanks for watching if this did help please leave a like and if you do have any questions or comments just leave them below and I'll soon to reply to you as soon as possible so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video